In the realm of fashion and personal style, colors play a significant role in expressing one's mood, personality, and even affecting the perception of others. However, according to the late Dolores Cannon, renowned author, and past-life regressionist, there exists one particular color that individuals should exercise caution in wearing. Cannon, known for her extensive exploration of metaphysical and spiritual concepts, shed light on the energetic impact of colors on human beings in her works. Throughout her career, Cannon delved into the intricacies of the human psyche and the subtle energies that surround individuals. In her teachings, she emphasized the importance of understanding how colors can influence one's vibrational frequency and overall well-being. While many colors are associated with positivity, vitality, and balance, there is one hue that Cannon warned against, black. Black, often regarded as a staple color in fashion due to its versatility and perceived sophistication, carries a weighty symbolism beyond its aesthetic appeal. According to Cannon, black possesses a unique energy that can potentially hinder an individual's spiritual growth and emotional equilibrium. She argued that wearing black excessively or exclusively could lead to a sense of stagnation, isolation, and even depression. Cannon's perspective on the color black stems from her belief in the interconnectedness of the mind, body, and spirit. She maintained that colors interact with the body's energy centers, or chakras, influencing various aspects of one's life, including emotional state and spiritual development. In this framework, black is often associated with the root chakra, which governs feelings of security, stability, and survival instincts. Wearing black exclusively may inadvertently block the flow of energy within the root chakra, leading to a sense of disconnection from oneself and the world around them. Cannon suggested that individuals who find themselves drawn to black attire on a regular basis should consider introducing lighter, more vibrant colors into their wardrobe to counterbalance the heavy energy associated with black. While Cannon's perspective on avoiding black attire may seem unconventional in the realm of fashion advice, her insights offer a deeper understanding of the relationship between color and consciousness. By being mindful of the colors we choose to wear, individuals can align themselves with energies that support their growth, vitality, and overall well-being. Dolores Cannon's teachings on the energetic properties of colors extend beyond mere fashion advice, they offer profound implications for personal growth and spiritual development. According to Canon, each color carries its own unique vibration, influencing not only our outward appearance but also our internal state of being. In this context, black is often associated with the absorption and suppression of energy rather than the expression and expansion of it. Canon suggested that wearing black can create a barrier between individuals and the flow of universal energy, inhibiting their ability to connect with their higher selves and the spiritual realm. This obstruction may manifest as feelings of heaviness, lethargy, or even a sense of being spiritually disconnected. Furthermore, Cannon emphasized the importance of balance in all aspects of life, including the colors we surround ourselves with. While black can symbolize elegance and authority, an excessive reliance on this color may tip the scales towards imbalance, particularly in terms of emotional and spiritual well-being. By diversifying one's wardrobe with a spectrum of colors, individuals can engage with a broader range of energies, fostering a sense of vitality, creativity, and emotional resilience. Each color holds its own significance and can evoke specific emotions and experiences, offering a rich tapestry of expression and exploration. In this light, Cannon's guidance encourages individuals to approach fashion not only as a means of self-expression but also as a tool for personal growth and spiritual evolution. By consciously selecting colors that resonate with their innermost being, individuals can align themselves with the vibrational frequencies that support their highest good. Dolores Cannon's insights prompt us to examine the subtleties of our everyday choices, including the colors we adorn ourselves with. In the case of black, while it may exude a sense of sophistication and timelessness, its energetic properties warrant careful consideration. Black, as Cannon suggests, has the tendency to absorb light and energy rather than reflect it. In the context of personal energy fields, this absorption can translate into a sense of heaviness or even emotional suppression. 
Individuals who find themselves drawn to black attire may unknowingly be seeking a sense of protection or concealment, but in doing so, they may inadvertently dampen their own vitality and spiritual receptivity. Furthermore, the symbolic associations of black, such as mourning or darkness, can subtly influence our subconscious minds, affecting our mood and outlook on life. While there is certainly a time and place for the somber elegance of black attire, Canon's teachings encourage us to balance its usage with lighter, more uplifting colors that nourish the spirit and ignite the imagination. In the realm of energy healing and spiritual practices, black is often associated with the concept of shadow work, the process of confronting and integrating aspects of ourselves that we may prefer to keep hidden or repressed. While this work is undoubtedly valuable for personal growth and self-awareness, relying too heavily on black may inadvertently reinforce a sense of stagnation or resistance to change. Therefore, Canon's guidance invites us to approach our relationship with black, and indeed, with all colors, with mindfulness and discernment. Rather than simply following fashion trends or societal norms, we are encouraged to tune into our inner guidance and choose colors that resonate with our true essence and highest potential. In essence, the danger of wearing black lies not in the color itself, but in the potential imbalance and stagnation it may symbolize. By embracing a diverse palette of colors that reflect the richness and complexity of our inner worlds, we open ourselves to a deeper experience of self-expression, connection, and spiritual growth. As we navigate the intricate dance of life, the wisdom imparted by Dolores Cannon invites us to approach each choice with intentionality and awareness. Whether selecting the colors of our clothing, decorating our living spaces, or engaging in interpersonal relationships, we are encouraged to consider the energetic implications of our actions. In the case of wearing black, Canon's teachings serve as a gentle reminder to remain attuned to the subtle energies at play within and around us. While black may hold its place in our wardrobes for certain occasions, its overuse or reliance can potentially hinder our spiritual growth and emotional well-being. By embracing a diverse array of colors that resonate with our inner truth and aspirations, we invite a sense of balance, harmony, and vibrancy into our lives. Each color carries its own unique frequency, offering us an opportunity to connect with different aspects of ourselves and the world around us. Furthermore, Canon's insights encourage us to cultivate a deeper understanding of the interconnectedness of all things. Just as colors influence our individual experiences, they also contribute to the collective consciousness, shaping the tapestry of human existence. In light of this understanding, let us heed the wisdom of Dolores Cannon and approach our lives with mindfulness, compassion, and reverence for the transformative power of color. By embracing the full spectrum of our being, we embark on a journey of self-discovery and spiritual awakening, enriching our lives and the lives of those around us. In essence, Dolores Cannon's insights into the energetic properties of colors offer us a deeper understanding of the subtle influences that shape our lives. Through her teachings, we are reminded of the power we hold to consciously co-create our reality, starting with something as seemingly simple as the colors we choose to surround ourselves with. As we integrate Cannon's wisdom into our daily lives, let us embark on a journey of self-exploration and conscious expression. Let us embrace the full spectrum of colors as a reflection of the diversity and richness of our inner worlds. By doing so, we not only enhance our personal well-being but also contribute to the collective evolution of humanity. Moreover, let us approach our interactions with others with the same level of mindfulness and intentionality. Just as colors can influence our individual experiences, our thoughts, words, and actions ripple outwards, shaping the world we inhabit. By embodying the qualities of compassion, kindness, and authenticity, we become agents of positive change in the world. In this way, Dolores Cannon's teachings serve as a guiding light, illuminating the path towards greater self-awareness, spiritual growth, and unity consciousness. As we navigate the complexities of existence, may we draw upon the wisdom of Cannon's insights to cultivate a life of meaning, purpose, and fulfillment. As we continue our journey of self-discovery and spiritual evolution, let us remain open to the lessons that colors can teach us. Each hue carries its own message, its own energy, and its own invitation for growth. 
By attuning ourselves to these subtle vibrations, we deepen our connection to ourselves, to others, and to the universe at large. In the grand tapestry of existence, every color has its place, every shade its purpose. From the radiant warmth of red to the tranquil depths of blue, from the vibrant energy of yellow to the grounding stability of green, each color offers us a unique opportunity for exploration and expansion. In embracing the full spectrum of colors, we embrace the full spectrum of life itself, its joys and sorrows, its light and shadow, its challenges and triumphs. By embracing both the darkness and the light, we come to know ourselves more fully and to embody our true essence with greater clarity and authenticity. In the end, Dolores Cannon's cautionary advice regarding the color black reminds us that balance is key in all things. Just as a painter carefully selects their palette to create a masterpiece, so too must we carefully choose the colors with which we paint the canvas of our lives. May we approach each day with reverence for the beauty and complexity of the world around us. May we honor the wisdom of Dolores Cannon and the countless other teachers who have illuminated the path before us. And may we walk forward with courage, compassion, and an unwavering commitment to living our lives in full color.